Hello everyone, I am Nidhi Shah. You are watching It's Tomorrow News. India is a country where winter and rain goes side by side. India being located in very strategically planned geographical location, it has certain regions that are battered by bone chilling cold and some are deluged under heavy rainfall. Like parts of Rajasthan have been witnessing cold wave conditions. For example, minimum temperature of Churu is 5 degree, which is below normal 5 degree. Similarly, some part of Rajasthan, Haryana and Madhya Pradesh have recorded minimum temperature between 6 and 7 degrees. Hisa recorded 6.1 degree, Narul 7 degree, Bilwara 7.4 degree and Umare record 7.4 degrees Celsius. Many other districts of this state including part of Chhattisgarh, Bihar and Jharkhand have recorded minimum temperature between 8 and 10 degrees. Northwesterly dry and cold wind are blowing across northwest central and east India since last few days. In fact, wherever there is a long gap between two western disturbances, cold wind from north and northwest continues across most part of country leading to drop in temperature. Moreover, clear skies help in cooling down the earth's surface as energy emitted by earth after sunset escape into the atmosphere. We do not expect any significant weather disturbances to approach western Himalaya during next one week. This means there will be not any rain activity over northern plain as well. Therefore, chances of fog formation is ruled out. Day will remain sunny and warm. Whereas the South Indian state have been battered by rainfall for past few days leading to massive flooding and throwing normal life out of gear. The regional meteorological center Chennai has predicted below normal rainfall over Puducherry and Tamil Nadu for next two weeks till December 8. Weather models showed a drop in rainfall. Up to Tuesday, there was a potential of isolated light to moderate rainfall over the state, said Additional Director General of Metrology. Due to relatively low moisture content in the air, Chennai may encounter hazy condition in early morning hour for two days. He said there were no significant weather system in Bay of Bengal that might have bucked heavy rain to Tamil Nadu. For the previous week, the northeast monsoon has slipped into break. The recent weather system was unable to offer the state widespread rain. Only 3 mm of rain fell in state from November 17 to November 23 compared to an average of 34 mm, a deficiency of over 91%. He said district recorded less rainfall than average while total number of 16 districts had no rainfall at all. That's all for now. For more news update, stay tuned with us. It's tomorrow news. For more global weather updates like this, subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon for regular updates.